a smart outlet for outdoors. Let's begin now. How you make your backyard smart? Be able to control it with Alexa, Google, or through an application. Well, what you need, you need an outdoor a smart plot. With this, you can control like water fountain, or Christmas light, any type of light, or anything that can be controlled outdoor. So let me show you this plot right now. So let's change camera. All right, we are back in the studio. So we see here the outdoor uh, plug, and we see here that we have channel one and channel two. It's not the uh, sync yet, but we can turn it off and turn it on. That's actually a uh, down switch right now. We have to make sure this blink, it doesn't blink that way. You're gonna hold it for like 30 seconds and to start blinking, it needs to be blinking fast. If blinking slow, it's not ready. Yeah? That's because it's looking, uh, it's looking for the network. now. When it's blink blinking it's slow, it's looking for network. When it blinking fast, it's required to be synced or installed for the first time. Now, for this, we're going to be using uh, a Smart Life, the application. Anyway, the only instructions are in the box. And the only thing you need to do is uh, a scan uh, with your phone. And it should be somewhere here, right there. So you're gonna scan the Smart Life, iOS, or an Android phone. So when you scan it, we got here the application. All right. So what I'm gonna do now, we're gonna add, and you see here I have many devices. We're gonna press the plus, run the top in the application, and we're gonna select switch. We select the switch, and we have to make sure it's blinking, and we see the blinking right there. Right, so we're gonna click confirm. Now make sure you are in a 2.4 network. Mine is set to 2.4 network. Make sure you select your network. I will say to shut down your data. Uh, if you got the data plan, turn it off and switch to 2.4. When you're done, you put it back to 5 gigahertz. So we confirm and we wait. And I really stop blinking, so they really find it pretty fast. So let's wait. I have Alexa too, so we should see a message coming up from Alexa. I think I found it already. I see the light. Yep, yep. We see Alexa right there. A message. Done. It's called a smart plug uh, uh, PI. I guess I have another smart plugs. So it's smart. Yeah, okay. So it's a smart outdoor plug. That's the name. That's fine. We can set the room that we want to set. We leave it the way it is now. We complete. And I'm going to switch, I'm going to put, and this is switch one and switch two. I'm going to put this light bulb in switch one, right there. And we see here that we got plug one and plug two. So plug one, see, turn it off. And if I hit two, if I have a light bulb there, it will turn it on as well. So we have two. So we can set now, we can set the schedules. We can set, like in my case, I have the wood I found. Comes every day at five o'clock turns off at midnight. And then I want my adult lighting to be on uh, nine o'clock and turn off at midnight. You can set weekends only once a day, and you can set it here by the clock and you set the schedule. Or well, we can now uh, tell Alexa to turn this on. So now what we can do, we can turn on all the lights or control each one, either switch one or switch two. But what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna tell Alexa to just turn everything on. Alexa, turn on a smart outdoor plug. See? Alexa, turn off a smart outdoor plug. And it's done. Now you can do exactly the same thing with Google. You can uh, control it to turn it off, to turn it on, set the schedule. That's a nice thing. Now, this application is what I use for, for all my uh, smart devices. So it's pretty simple. A few seconds, make sure this blinks fast. Make sure you run in a network that is at 2.4 for the initial setup. When you're done, you can throw your back your data and you can switch your phone to 5 gigahertz. And you're done. You did this one and it's that's it. Thank you.